What's up? How are you guys today? We're gonna do a little grocery haul. I'm gonna show you my fridge, pantry, everything I've been eating lately. I'm wearing my hat this morning because my hair is a mess. And uh, it is the Wi-Fi shielding hat if you want to protect your brain a little bit from the radiation, but let's take a look around. As always, my kitchen is a little bit of a mess with the limited space. We got stuff everywhere. So this is the apple cinnamon oatmeal that I've been having for breakfast. Here is just uh, a garlic puree that I put in the bean dip. I'll show that in a little bit. And here is our precious sourdough bread that you can <laughs> beat someone to death with. <laughs> uh, crust is a little hard. This one was cooked a few minutes too long, but it's still good. We have that usually for lunch with our soup. I take slices of the bread and uh, on occasion I will have steak tartare with the bread as well. Most of the stuff is in the fridge, so we'll start with the breakfast. We have our pork loin. Uh, these should actually be in a marinade, but I ran out of apple cider vinegar, so usually I have these sitting in vinegar, maple syrup, some sugar, and a little bit of salt. We have these on Frankie's free range meat, highest quality Iberico pork. I like it in the morning because having some like somewhat sweet pork is kind of appealing i don't always want to have steak tartare in the morning which i have been trying uh, which i'll take some beef tenderloin uh, we have this on frankie's true range meat as well i'll dice it up nice and thin sometimes if i'm lazy i'll have some ground beef but usually not and then i made a puree of steak tartare ingredients so this is like mustard capers shallot some oil and some of our collagen broth so I just take a teaspoon of this and I put it on the meat and then I have steak tartare really, really quick so I don't have to like prep or chop anything. And then for lunch, uh, we have that bread I showed you guys and I have my soup in here. So I'll just take a few spoonfuls of the barley stew that has some beef in there, onions, a little bit of wine, collagen broth, and uh, put that in a pan on the stove and I'll have lunch within five minutes. Very fast, very easy. Usually make this once or twice a week. There's the collagen broth. I'll put that in the soup sometimes and then I'll have it at night with the udon noodles, which also get our white bean puree. Uh, running a little low on this, I might have to make some today. But this is white beans, onion, garlic, a little bit of oil. Uh, really just pureeing the beans so I can add a lot of fiber to my diet by using it as like a pasta sauce for the noodles. I've been liking this a lot. It's been a significant addition to my diet. And then with the Udon noodles, I'll take some roast beef from Frankie's Free Range Meat. If I can get the camera to focus. And I'll dice this up and I'll put it in the noodles so I don't have to cook any meat for dinner. It's very fast prep. If I do have some meat for dinner, usually I'll go for the 95.5 lean blend we have on Frankie's Free Range Meat or the best burger blend. Uh, so that's really everything for the most part up here. And then uh, today we're going to do our testicle routine. So here I have some lamb testicles from Frankie's Strange Meat that have been thawing out in the fridge overnight. We'll probably have a half of a large one and I should get a significant energy boost and also some mental clarity, guys. This is very important for focus and, and you should notice that after you have it, you know, you feel a little sharper uh, even up to four or five days a week. So whenever I feel a little dull, I'm assuming I need a testosterone boost and then I'll have this. Uh, over here on the shelf of the fridge is just some capers, mustard that we put in the tartare puree and then I have my kefir grains that I have you know a teaspoon usually with lunch now on the table over here we have a mess of mastic powder and the mastic comes in here all blitzed up we have that with every meal I have some water kefir that I drank over the past two days we have our glass bottle of mineral water and then we have the supplements on Oregon supplements right now I'm mostly taking B complex and vitamin C and minerals on occasion but I have done videos on that if you guys want uh, see more about that and on the floor over here is my water so we have the mountain valley water that i'm cooking with the fuji water that i drink and then here we have just uh, another fresh bottle of water kefir that we took home from frankie strange uh, foods this is the ginger i've been liking this a lot um, very nice balance and guys we put so much effort into making this water kefir it's double ferment with all the electrolytes which means we're putting in coconut water high calcium mineral water magnesium organic sugar initially and then we do a second ferment with like dried fruits ginger fresh lemons for the antiscorbutic properties really 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 uh, time intensive and expensive and it's the highest quality 
probiotic you can have. So that's everything I've been eating lately. The only thing that's missing is apples because I just ran out. Uh, I got to go to uh, the store today and buy some more apples as well as some more ingredients for the bean puree. Uh, there's a few other things lying around my kitchen, uh, like the sourdough starters, um, a few prep things, but we should be doing that recipe for tomorrow. Uh, so you guys will see that. Granted, I don't lose my mind uh, making that video. But I guess that's really it. Uh, if you guys have any questions about the foods or the kitchen equipment, uh, you can check out Frankie Strange Meat, Frankie Strange Foods. You'll see most of that stuff. You can also go to my Amazon shop and you'll see all of those links on my website, frankdestefano.com. Oh, almost forgot. These are the udon noodles that I have every night for dinner. Uh, I think these are 4 or $5 per bag. So it does get expensive having one of these every day. But uh, they sit good in my stomach. I feel good eating them. And... Um, the only noodle I can really have for dinner. If I wasn't having these noodles, I'd have to have potatoes or uh, some other starch. Yeah, when, I, when I ran out of the apples, uh, I had some dried pineapple in here as backup. And we also had some organic raisins on the table. But that's it, guys. Check frankdestefano.com. Go through all those sites, the stores and stuff, and see if you have anything that interests you. But a lot of the stuff you guys are going to see in my day of eatings, you've seen it already. So as always, please drop a like on the video. Leave a comment down below, subscribe and check that notification bell, and I will see you guys soon. Uh, we might do a live stream uh, Saturday or Sunday at 3 p.m. for you guys, uh, so just keep an eye out for that too.